Alright guys, it's Stick as a Guy, and today I'm bringing you guys my one year anniversary video on YouTube. Um, I made my YouTube account sometime like July 2010, like a really long time ago, but I posted my first video August 28th, 2012, so this video is one day late, so I'm sorry for that, but at least I did it, so anyways, it might be a little bit long, so I'm going to try to get into it. What you're watching right now is my first ever video, um, but uh, Gameplay is going to be playing after this. So this might be a little bit long, so I'm going to try to get into it really quick. So basically, um, I started gaming when I was like four years old. My parents bought me a Game Boy Advance. So they started me like when I was pretty young. Uh, I got the game Super Mario Advance and Crazy Racers, which was like some racing game. And I still actually have both those games now. And I play them sometimes because <laughs> they're fun. But um, yeah, so basically I got those when I was like four. I believe uh, I just kept getting games for my Game Boy, played like other games like Pokemon and stuff because who didn't have Pokemon if you had a Game Boy or like anything else. Um, when I uh, saw so I just kept getting a bunch of games, kept playing my Game Boy and then when I was seven I believe I got a GameCube and uh, I got the games Super Monkey Ball 2 and Pikmin I believe was the second one. And um, so I played those games a lot, I played them with my dad sometimes. And, um, we, and I just, I played a bunch of GameCube games, and we just got a bunch more, so basically, my parents just, like, got me into gaming when I was really, really young, so they're the ones to blame <laughs> for me playing games, <laughs> no, no, um, yeah, so, I had a GameCube, and I just kept, like, playing GameCube games, and I went, like, a lot of the time I'd go to other people's houses and play, like, their PlayStation 2s and stuff, or PlayStation 1s, like, the OG stuff, um, but I never, I never had, like, the PlayStation 1 or, like, the early Xbox, but I had played them at, like, my friend's house and stuff, but I still had my GameCube, and I was like, oh, I wish, that'd be really cool if I had, like, that PlayStation 1, that's really sick, man, and, uh, stuff like that, and then, uh, when I got into third grade, the game RuneScape was, like, really, really popular, it might have been popular a little before that, but, like, everyone was playing it, we had, like, our own, like, clans and stuff that we'd, like, organize, and, uh, yeah, and um, one of my friends, he like, he got me into it. My parents didn't want me to playing the game because they were like, oh, it's too violent or something like that, which is reasonable because I was in third grade. But if you've ever seen RuneScape, it's like not, no, just no. <laughs> but yeah, so I was at his house and um, that was like the only time I could play it was when I was not at my house. So my parents wouldn't know because <laughs> I was hardcore. And um, so I was like playing at his house and I was like, oh, that'd be cool. I should like make my own account or something. And he's like, yeah, so we were trying to come up with names, and, uh, eventually, we were, like, trying to come up with stuff, and then we, like, got the idea of, like, some, like, stick guy or something like that, or, like, I don't know, some, something like that, I don't know how we got to that, but, uh, he came up with stick as a guy, and we came up with stick as a guy, I'm like, oh, yeah, that's cool, so I've used that as my username for everything since, like, third grade, <laughs> so that's where the name stick as a guy comes from, and stick is just short for stick as a guy, and, uh, yeah. So that's how I got my name. <laughs> but anyways, so after RuneScape, I still had my GameCube. And um I had my GameCube for a really long time and I played like Super Smash Bros, Zelda, I still have all these games. because uh, they're beast. <laughs> but after uh after a while, I think in sixth grade, uh, one of my friends who lives like a block from me, uh, I don't talk to him as much anymore. But uh in during like during sixth grade, uh during the summer. I hung out with him like every single day, and we'd go, and we'd uh, we'd play hockey in his in his uh, driveway, and then afterwards we'd go inside and go play World at War, like Call of Duty World at War, um, and uh, it was like he didn't have online, so we'd just play split screen, and uh, we were both terrible, but it was funny, and it was really enjoyable, and uh, so we basically we played World at War. We did like zombies and stuff, where you just camp in the corner on Notch on Toten because <laughs> it sucked. And that was like the only strategy at the time. But um, after that, I like that was pretty much the first time I'd played Call of Duty. I'd played like Call of Duty 2, like a really long time before that, but it was like one time, so I wouldn't really count it. But yeah, I played World at War at his house a lot, and uh, it was really fun. And I kind of that's how I got into Call of Duty. I'm like, this is this is a really awesome game. I should totally like get this somehow for my GameCube. <laughs> but and, yeah, and then uh, one day. We were playing the Wii at his house, and I was like, this is hardcore, man, and I, I, like, asked my parents if I could get a Wii, 
And uh, finally, after like six months, maybe, maybe not six months, not not too much longer, but uh, they got a Wii, and then uh, still have the Wii and like all the GameCube games for it. I'd prefer to play the GameCube games than the Wii games, but uh, so we got a Wii, and then I think in seventh grade, one of my friends, the friend who uh, gave me my RuneScape name, <laughs> he uh, he had an Xbox, and he got rid of it to get a PlayStation. He was like, all right, Xbox is stupid. I want a PlayStation. And then uh, finally he was like, okay, PlayStation stupid, I want an Xbox. I was like, that doesn't make any sense. And uh, he was selling his PlayStation. I was like, oh, maybe I could, because he was just going to sell it. I was like, maybe I could buy that from you or something. He's like, yeah, sure. So he gave it to me for 200 bucks with a controller, a microphone, and a ton of games. And uh, one of them was Modern Warfare 2 and uh, World at War. I don't know all the other games I got. I got like FIFA 08, maybe. I could go lick. I don't have too many games for my PlayStation. But, um... Yeah, and then he gave me, like, Mafia, and I had to sell that because my parents were like, you can't have that, and then they also made me sell Red Dead Redemption. But, um, yeah, so, I basically just played Modern Warfare 2 because I thought the game was beast, and uh, I still do, <laughs> except for the hackers, they annoy me. Um, yeah, so, I got, I was just playing Modern Warfare 2 a lot, and, um, during, this was, like, during Modern Warfare 2, it, um, I don't think Black Ops had been out yet, and, uh, I was like... I got into watching some YouTube videos, like, I was searching up, like, different Modern Warfare 2 stuff, like, watching the Machinima videos, like, glitch spots and stuff, I don't even remember all the crap I watched, and, um, so that's kind of how I got started into YouTube, just, like, interested in other stuff, I guess, I, I don't even, just, whatever I just said, yeah, that, <laughs> that's how I got into YouTube, um, that's how I started into watching videos, anyways, and, um, so, uh, I made a YouTube account, mainly so I could, like, and comment vi on videos and stuff like that, and that's pretty much it. Um, I never thought I was going to actually post anything on my channel. But I finally, um... Uh, I finally, what, what am I saying? Yeah, no. <laughs> Where was I? Oh, yeah. So, Modern Warfare 2. Um, I finally, um... Like, was watching these videos, and I saw, like, some sniping stuff on Machinima, I believe. And I was like, alright, this is pretty cool. I think I can do this. So I made an account called Leak Quickscopes, because I was just the best around. I made this account called Leak Quickscopes, so that I could quickscope in Modern Warfare 2, and I uh, figured out after a couple games that I was the worst quickscoper ever, and uh, after a while I just quit, I was like, okay, this is impossible, I can't figure it out, and uh, I just quit, and then uh, one day, for some reason, I just came back, I was like, alright, I'm doing it again, I made a new account, I made a clan, I think, called Waitlist, my account was like Waitlist Time or something really, really awful like that with like all the numbers and everything it was just terrible and uh, no one joined because I was so bad so after a while I just quit again I was like alright I'm done it's over I'm not sniping anymore so I quit again I quit for the second time then one day I was like hey okay I think I can maybe if I don't lead my own clan maybe if I just like join a clan or something and uh, I came across this clan in search and destroy called legit and uh, they were the coolest people ever and I joined their game, and I was like, can I 1v1 you to join your clan or something like that? And they're like, yeah, totally. So I joined, and uh, I made this clan called Legit .0K RC. It was pretty awesome. No, I don't think they even had a YouTube. I really hope not, because we were sucky. And after I joined, they just completely stopped coming online. And uh, I, I don't know if it was me, or I just sucked. And they were like, no, quitting forever. But, uh, <laughs> so like, yeah, I joined this clan called Legit, and... Uh, um, they just left, and I was like, alright, this is stupid. And I think I quit again for the third time. I was like, alright, I'm done with sniping again. And, um, one day I was like, okay, maybe I should, like, make a clan or something. So I made a clan called Toon, and that's not Toon Sector, it was a completely different Toon. I made a clan called Toon, and, um, I didn't know how to get people to join, so on my YouTube channel, I posted, like, five comments on five different videos throughout, like, the span of a week. And, uh, no one saw them except for one person named OneShot1020, and, uh, he's pretty much the main reason that I do YouTube videos. I doubt he's watching this, but if he is, then sup, man. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's, like, pretty much the reason that I'm making videos. If I have never met him, if I had never met him, I would not be making videos. Or, uh, I'd probably not even be, I'd probably still be playing Call of Duty, but I wouldn't even, like, be involved in clans or anything like that. Or sniping. So, um, yeah, so what happened is he saw my, my, uh, comment on, like, some phase video, maybe, I don't even know what I commented on, but he, uh, he's like, yeah, I'd want to join, and he had a PVR, so he, like, 
allowed us to be able to make videos. We never did because we were bad. We couldn't even hit clips. And uh, so he, um, yeah, and then he finally left. He was like, all right, your clan is dumb. We are not even making videos or anything. I'm like, yeah, that's true. And he left, and then he joined a different clan called Toon, which was Toon Sector. And um, I was like, oh, yeah, you think you're good? You can join Toon? Well, I can join Toon, too. So I, like, I... Uh, <laughs> I tried out for Toon or something. I don't even remember how I got in. I think I like 1v1 some guy to get in. <laughs> but yeah, so I, I got into Toon and they were like, um, I followed and I followed one shot or Joey and um, they, he was like, how, you, you can't be in this clan. I'm in this clan or something like that. And I'm like, oh, it's too bad for you or something. So I got in and um, I, got, I was a little bit better. I kept getting better at sniping and stuff. And I was about, uh, I made an episode, which is what you just watched earlier. Um, I sent off the clips to an editor, and once I sent them off to him, I actually tried editing the clips myself, and I was terrible at it. Um, I just, <laughs> I sucked, um, I couldn't even figure out how to sync or, like, anything, add effects, but it was really bad. That's pretty much how I started off editing. I still have the video private on my channel. Um, probably still have it on my computer as well. And, uh, yeah, so, um, while I was in tune, I met some people, um, like meds, warp, ice, aka Uno, um, buys, ninja, ranger. Um, I probably listed multiple people twice. Wilkins, like warp. If I just sat here naming all of them, it would take forever. <laughs> but uh, yeah, if I didn't say your name, trust me, I didn't forget about you. Um, but yeah, so while I was in tune, I met all those people, and um, I just like hung out with them, and uh, well, like. Not, not literally hung out with them, but like over a game. Uh, but yeah, so while I was in tune, I hung out with these people and just like talked to them about stuff. And um, I heard about this clan called Fame. And uh, um, I had a person from Fame on my friends list. I'm pretty sure he was a Fame fanboy, but uh, I could be wrong. So he, um, or I, I was looking into Fame. I was like, okay, this is pretty cool. I watched Retaliation, which was the big team Taj. I was like, alright, this is pretty sweet, and uh, one day, um, I, or I like, not one day, um, while I was in tune, I like, was looking up to Fame, I was like, okay, Fame's like a really beast clan, and um, one day, Frix, the leader, subscribed to me, and I was like, maybe he's like looking at my channel, maybe he wants me to join Fame or something, so I started talking to him over Skype, and he was like, um, he, did, he let me do like a private RC, and he was like, alright, he gave me four clips to edit, and um, uh, because at this point I had like finally I had transferred from like sniping to editing because I was a lot better at that or in my opinion and um so that's how I got into fame he let me do this RC and he watched it and he was like alright this, this is good you want to join I was like yeah man so I, was in, <laughs> so I was in fame for like nine months while I was in fame I met like a ton of people too like JLH my homie the boss turkey oh yeah like I said if I list off all the people it'll take me forever um, I might just put a thing in the description, like, listing off everyone, but I might forget someone, so I'll feel bad. But, uh, um, yeah. Anyways. Um, so, well, I was in fame for, like, nine months, and just, like, kept, like, editing and stuff, meeting more people, and, uh, doing whatever, and then, um, yeah, and then one day I was, or not one day, um, why do I keep saying one day? <laughs> um, I started looking at RCs, because I was like, alright, I kind of want to, move up to a new clan even though I love fame um so I uh, started like looking for uh, new RC's or not new RC's like looking for RC's and stuff and I did the TS one the trauma one and then the hawk one and I uh, won the hawk one and joined hawk like in my opinion probably one of the best PS3 clans if not the best PS3 clan only and uh, so now I'm in hawk now which is pretty cool and uh, yeah I think I think I've covered any, everything. Um, I tried doing this commentary before, but it, it broke, and it just deleted all my audio, so I might have forgot something, and I thought I said it, but I said it last commentary, but anyways, um, thanks for the support over the last year, or last week, maybe a day, maybe you've just subscribed now, maybe you haven't subscribed, maybe you'll never subscribe, <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, thanks for the support, if you liked it, you can like it, uh, you can subscribe for more if you haven't done that already, and uh, that's about it, thanks for watching, goodbye.